Hi, I'm Eric Gervais from Cargis. I'm the sales manager in the CRM business unit, and I wanted to quickly walk you through the LinkedIn Sales Navigator integration with Salesforce. So um, the LinkedIn Sales Navigator uh, integration can be downloaded directly from AppExchange. And when you uh, download that AppExchange app, you can install it and configure it in multiple different objects within the system. Um, so you can install it in leads, accounts, contacts, and opportunities. I'm going to take you into an account to show you what that looks like. Uh, so when you're on the account record, there'll be a little uh, widget here on the right hand side that will drive you directly into uh, that account record inside of LinkedIn Sales Navigator. You'll be able to see uh, some basic details about the company. Uh, so you see here are some basics about how big the company is, where, they, where they're located. It also has a whole listing of recommended leads and you can actually save leads directly to Sales Navigator from the Salesforce interface. And then there's a bunch of other options here so you can make other connections uh, within the team and you can make connections directly from Salesforce of members of the uh, accounts team. And you can also uh, go in and see any news that might be happening about that account uh, directly from uh, the Salesforce interface. Uh, so that's part one. Uh, you can also go to leads and accounts. Uh, so I'm going to jump over to uh, Esther Angel here, uh, who is another record that we have in the lead object inside of Salesforce. And instead of a more holistic company-based view, you're getting an individual-based view in the, in the lead record. So you see here you have some basics about uh, this lead, Esther Angel, what her current role is, where she was previously. You can also see the sales navigator. You can see some of the articles that she shared um, and other individuals if they have good recommendations for you. In this case, they do not. You can even go into Get Introduced for other leads. Uh, same ways that you would use Sales Navigator more regularly. Um, and here's some people that might be able to introduce you directly to Esther that you might already be connected to. Um, so uh, lots of functionality there. And leads and contacts are fairly similar in this instance. So if I go to a contact record, you see here I can match this uh, contact record directly to this contact and you see it will get the same kind of information as it did at the lead level on the contact record. And then finally, um, when you're actually inside of uh, Sales Navigator, uh, you also have some opportunities to pass information back uh, to Salesforce so you can actually type a message here. Really nice to meet you. Love to reconnect next week. And then when you hit this log the CRM button and send, that will actually log that uh, email activity directly into Salesforce. Um, you can also see that uh, there's a record here that tells you that this, this person from Sales Navigator already lives in CRM, so it does some kind of connections back and forth between Salesforce and Sales Navigator. Um, there's some more advanced settings uh, for uh, validating data and things like that, but we'll kind of cover that in another video. But this is a great starting point to think about all the value that you can provide from LinkedIn Sales Navigator and Salesforce together.